Hello my friends and channel subscribers, Greg here from Brass Business Brisbane Australia with another uncut, unedited, no bull video. Today I would like to talk about diabetes, in specifically diabetes type 2. Uh, full disclaimer, I'm not a doctor. Everything that I say today, feel free to consult with your doctor, your search engine, your friends, whoever you want. The whole purpose of this video is to save your health, save your life, and make sure that you understand how did you get to point where you're at right now. What is diabetes type 2? What's the difference between type 2 and type 1? And why is type 2 is reversible and you have to start doing it right now. Let's start again with uh, what diabetes is. Diabetes is inability of your body to handle glucose in the blood. It's not scientific, I'm just explaining how it is and then we cascade uh, what's the diabetes type 1 and type 2. So diabetes type 1 most of the time is genetically induced. That means that you might have born with predisposition to uh, diabetes type 1 and diagnosed with it at some stage in your life and your doctor prescribed your uh, uh, glucose monitor and also insulin injections to correct it. What's diabetes type 1? Diabetes type 1 is your pancreas inability to provide you with enough insulin to suppress glucose in, in the bloodstream. So to compensate for pancreas dysfunction, you um, inject in more insulin. Uh, sorry, yeah, more insulin in, 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 in the body like as an artificial one and that creates glucose level in the bloodstream. Glucose level in the bloodstream creates all sorts of problems. It uh, creates uh, radical damage, oxidation, strokes and so on. Um, it's a terrible disease and why type 2 is different from type 1? Because type 1 is an ability of pancreas to create insulin or enough insulin. When type 2, it's a pure insulin resistance. That means there's enough insulin in your blood or, uh, or, or in your system excreted by uh, pancreas and everything, but your cells not accepting it or not accepting glucose, right? So, I probably confused you more than help. Let's unwrap it. So, you eat something that is a carbohydrate or something sweet or something that creates glucose. And glucose is supposed to go into cells uh, in your body and when your cells are full there's an insulin excreted and stored as a fat right so the more insulin you give to cells they become insulin resistant that means you give keep giving them uh, insulin and they just reject more and more and more and it becomes to the point where whatever you consume need to be extinguished by insulin that means almost one-to-one -one ratio and then everything getting overwhelmed and that is called insulin resistant or diabetes type 2 and the reason why you measure glucose uh, level in your blood to, to understand where you're at is because if your body or cells reject more glucose that means uh, more free glucose in the bloodstream and your pancreas getting overwhelmed and, and so on so what can you do to help yourself or your friend that pre-diabetic, I'm, I'm talking about diabetes type 2 or already diabetic type 2, don't put them on medication. Medication will just, when I say don't put on medication, please, I'm not a doctor, again, go consult with a doctor, but most likely path the doctor will prescribe you is how to provide more insulin so you get rid of that glucose. While diabetes type 1 require, or in most cases require, that kind of intervention, type 2 is reversible. The insulin sensitivity is reversible. And what should you do? First of all, of course, you need to limit the amount of glucose you consume. It's obvious this is what led you to, in the first place to... Um, uh, you know, 
now for your cells not to accept glucose anymore but what you can do is start fasting or intermittently eating because every time you eat uh, carbohydrates or sometimes even protein it will spike your glucose blood glucose levels and it will require insulin to suppress it so if you can avoid those spikes your cells that need glucose will become sensitive again and will start accepting glucose and this is how you reverse diabetes type 2 so there's a two ways first one remove all or most carbohydrates from your diet eat moderate amount of protein and eat less not less in quantity less in times have two meals a day have one meal a day fast for 16 18 24 hours everything is great until 60 hours of fast and if you truly truly trying to help yourself and not trying with excuses that that's it is genetic that's my parents you know gave it to me because they, they had diabetes if it is not diabetes type 1 it is reversible many people who did it yes it's not easy yes sweet stuff it's tasty and it's addictive yes that's what leads us like whole western diet leads us to diabetes type 2 at some stage in life and if you eat well if you sleep well if you try not to stress that will reduce amount of problem and if you do it all slowly but you increasing that intensity of intervention as as diet exercise sleep less stress you can surely reverse diabetes type 2 i hope this video was helpful to you or to someone that you're trying to help and please pass it on feel free to share if you like this video or any other videos on my channel feel free to subscribe hit the like button, hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my other videos on this channel. And please let me know in the comments down below uh, what other videos you would like to see, what would be helpful to you or to your family or friends, and I'll try to create more. Thank you so much for watching. Greg from Brisbane, Australia. Until next time.